We start with word that taxpayers in Wilkes-Barre will not see a tax hike in 2020. Mayor Tony George just unveiled what's expected to be his last budget at City Hall. And lead I-Team reporter Andy Mahalshik is live in Council Chambers with the story. Andy. And good afternoon, Kelly. We are live outside Wilkes-Barre City Hall. This will be Mayor Tony George's swan song because he lost on both the Democratic and Republican tickets in the May primary uh, uh, running for re-election. So this will be it pending some election night miracle next month. Let me show you some video taken a short time ago. Mayor Tony George announced at 11 o'clock this morning a 2020 budget with no tax increase. He says he was able to hold the line on expenses and keep the city without a tax increase. Now, he did have a tax increase his first year in office three years ago, but three consecutive years now, he says through uh, creative finance, he has been able to hold the line on taxes. But he's also aware that the city is on the verge of entering the state's Act 47 distressed status, which would mean the state could take over the city and basically run the budget. That's not happening as of this point, and the mayor says that this budget will help the city avoid that Act 47 status. I asked the mayor what was able where he was able to come up with the money to balance a budget because he said it was $2 million shortfall, but here's what he told me. Actually, we're fortunate with all the construction we're going to have to make sure we have two hotels in LCTA, which will bring us in all, we, we figure over $2 million in, in uh, permit cut fees. Mayor Tony George said again the costs of the pension co pension commitments and medical expenses are always going up, but he said that he had been able to negotiate with city unions to maintain those costs, keep them uh, not as high as expected. So the $52 million budget uh, uh, unveiled this morning. City Council still has to give its approval. Now keep in mind, uh, he will be replaced by George Brown, the mayor, in January. The mayor, George Brown, can look at this budget and make changes, but city council has the ultimate say in approving or not approving this budget. More on what council has to say, as well as taxpayers, coming up on later editions of Eyewitness News and, of course, on PAHomepage.com. Reporting live outside Wilkes-Barre City Hall, Andy Bahal, Chicago Eyewitness News. Kelly, back to you. A busy day there. All right, Andy, thanks for that live report.